Over the years, I've talked a lot about the cellist of Sarajevo. I heard this story years ago. Charlie Peacock brought it to my attention when I was struggling with the place and of uh, the music and art and creativity play in our lives. Uh, he told me the story of this man during the Bosnian War who had set up his cello in the middle of these bombed out areas in Bosnia. And he played this protest of beauty in the middle of these war zones. And that has become such a, a mobilizing metaphor for me for the uh, not just the Christian life, but for the creative life. And what I see there is that it's so easy to look at a hole and talk about the hole and the crater and how it got there and who's to blame for it and its width and its depth. And uh, we can kind of get lost in analysis of this crater that's here. It takes a generative person to get down into that crater and say, what would I build? I'm gonna build something here. And to me, as a songwriter and as a creative person, uh, I want to encourage people to that end, to be generative. So this summer I was just so excited to see a dream come true in, in hosting our first songwriter workshop and retreat. We called it workshop and retreat because it had elements of both. We were, uh, we were talking about the nuts and bolts of songwriting and actual um, process and those kinds of things. And then we also took time to eat together to talk about uh, broader ideas about the role of the artist in the world and what, what that looks like. So many areas of our life have been professionalized where we feel like we don't have access to them. And part of the mission of Art House is to encourage people to pick up the crayons and to draw again and to um, write music and to enter into these places that you might think only the professionals do that. Um, so it was a wonderful experience. We had a really broad range of people come. Uh, people that were already vocationally in the arts, people that were uh, wanting to reawaken a dream and a, and a talent that they'd held for a long time, um, had maybe been hidden for a while, and people who were just embarking and asking the question, like, can I do this? And um, it was just an incredible time to see everybody um, really advance with that, uh, that vision of getting down into the crater and